what is up everyone and welcome back to yet another episode of Mega Man Battle Network 6 Psy Beast Gregor. If you saw the first episode, you saw how excited I was for this playthrough because it's been two years since we played Mega Man, Mega Man Battle Network. So it's just gonna feel pretty good to finish to finally finish the series because we played Map Battle Network 1 through 5, and now we got to get through 6, and then that's it for the Battle Network series. And I've been doing this since I probably like early high school i've been doing these playthroughs i think if i remember correctly it's been a while since i recorded bad network one but it feels pretty good man i think it was middle school i started recording bad network one i don't i'm not too sure but anyways i'm we're here in the last episode we we moved to a new town cyber cyber city and we started we started a new academy a cyber academy we left we left acdc and we we made it to school and we met mitch or mick mick whatever his name is i keep forgetting his name and he's tried to set the room ablaze, but he was not able to because the Mega Man was able to walk around the new, the real world, and cool off all these bots that are chilling inside of the, of the room. But now, what our next step is, we want to try to talk to, to the teacher again, Miss Mr. Mock. Oh no, everyone saw me fail. You need this to get into the teacher's room. Take this. And we got the teacher ID. Help. All right, so now what we want to do, we want to head on out of here. We want to head back down to the first floor because we need to stop what's going on and stop Mitch from being stupid because he's already being stupid trying to set the school ablaze. So we want to go to the teacher's room, which I believe is this way. Yep. And see what's going on in here. Hey, stop it, stop it, you guys. That's enough. You're gonna hurt the teachers. Oh, so he, he doesn't want to hurt the teachers. He just wanted to hurt me. Yikes. Mick, Mick, that's his name, not Mitch. Mick, hurry up and shut them down. Uh, I'm trying, but they're not listening to me. But aren't they being controlled by your Navi? Y yeah. Stop it, Blastman, Blastman. You're going overboard. Isn't this what you wished for? Didn't you want to shake them up? All I wanted to do was scare Land the others a little. I didn't want to go. I didn't want it to go this far. Hmm. Coward. Maybe you should run away. But I'm going to do what I want. You can suffer too, for all I care. Blastman. Blastman. Darn it! He cut me off. Uh oh. Got some more. Got some more bots. Ah, we're trapped. Oh, the heat. Oh man, dude. This is the end. Don't give up, everyone. Where's Blastman? I don't care how many pet battles you fought. You can't win against Blastman. And I don't care how strong he is. I've got to do something before it's too late. If you want to help, tell me where he is. He's in that control system. Let's go, Mega Man. Okay, Jack in Mega Man XQ. Let's freaking go. Alrighty, we are here. It's really hot. It's dangerous here with the raging heat fanning the flames. I see. We've got to find find and beat Blastman ASAP. Looks like a lost little critter has wandered in. Better get out fast before you become a crispy critter. Just you wait, Blastman. We're gonna put out your fire. Go for it, Mega Man. Okay. There won't be anything left after I reduce you to, yet to ashes. Alrighty, so this is the, the robot control or ro robo control. I, I don't know, man. The robo control computer. There we go. That's what it's called. So there's gonna be three things we want to get here. Um, well, one thing's one's optional, but two are I'm gonna get because they're BMDs. Uh, so BMDs, if you don't know what BMDs are, if you didn't watch the last episode, they're the blue mystery data, and I'm going to call it a green mystery data, it's DMDs. So BMDs, GMDs. And then there's also going to be PMDs, which is purple mystery data, which we can't really do anything about because we need an unlocker for that, which we don't have enough, we don't have any money for that. But yeah, so there's going to be two BMDs we want to grab, but we're going to be getting them as we proceed forward in the RoboComputer. Terrible, terrible, this is unheard of, record breaking. Calm down, what in the world happened? The fire is already this intense. My friends are going to be burned up at this rate. What? A red navy that came in just now caused all this. I'm resistant to heat, 
so I'm okay, but... Uh, if this keeps up, th this computer will melt down from the heat. I'm begging you, save my friends and get them out, please. Gotcha. I'll give it a shot. Wow, you're really brave. Well, you'll need this then. And we got water data. Just be careful about one thing. Once in a while, the red navy shoots out a wave of flames. Ha! Speaking of flame waves, here comes one now. It's best not to move, move when it happens. Oh, ooh, ooh, okay, that's, that's scary. Before a wave, little embers will show where the flames will come from. Stand behind a cube like we did. Okay. This is now, and it will block the wave. If there's something you don't understand, ask away. Now, please go save my friends. Alright, oh man, that's kind of scary. That is very scary. Be careful. A vicious red navy shooting flames. Uh, hide in the shadows of the cubes to save yourself. Alright. You can tell which way the fire will, will come from by where the embers rise. If you don't understand, by all means, just ask. Okay. So, oh, yep, whenever that happens, you want to... Okay. Let's see, let's see, let's see what, 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 what's over here. Ooh, okay. Ooh, this was... Okay. Okay, there's one, there's one navy right there. There's, a, there's green mystery data over here that we want to grab. So how do I... Oh, here we go. And if you're wondering, I'm fo I'm I'm following a guide to help me get through this, just so we're not struggling super super much. This is a blind playthrough because I don't know what's, what the hell's going on in this story. Well, I, well, I have an idea of what's going on in this story because I played Battle Network one through five, but I haven't I haven't actually played Battle Network six. So I am following a guide like I, like I do for all my playthroughs, so I can give y'all 100 percent a walkthrough if y'all decide to play this game. So, ouch, 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 ouch! You're at critical. Oh why? Oh why? Hold on, I'll save you. Okay, with that we just we just spread, spread some water data that we received from the first Mr. Pro program to cool you off. Phew, I'm still almost good as new. Please, you have to go save my friends. I would like to help, but it's gotten so dangerous. Excuse me, excuse me while I find cover. And with that, it's gonna skedaddle. Alrighty. So the way you're gonna be able to tell where the uh, where the fireballs are gonna come from, if, if you look at the embers if we get one here in a second oh uh, well we saw mystery games we have to fight too okay we have crack shot we want to use that do some of that so we're going to want to oh okay yeah i forgot i forgot how those guys play i got it's been a while so there we go we got it we got a counter so they only attack you when you're in when you're in their in their range so which means these fire dudes will only attack whenever, like I said, when you're in the range. Like right here. I was trying to get the counter hit there, but I wasn't able to get it. That's okay. I don't know what, I forget what they're called. I didn't, I didn't look at the thing. Oh, we got BMD right here. Which will be a spreader 1M, which will be really nice to have. Oh, we want to keep on going. So yeah, it seems like each... Oh. Oh yep. See, you see how it's going south or east or south? Yeah, south. We have to we have to block southwards. We get a cannon C, which will come in handy for because I believe that's a mega a mega I believe. So let me actually go ahead and equip one of those because if we get if we get an A B C cannon, then we'll be able to do a su a me I forget what's a mega a mega cannon or something like that I believe if I remember correctly. Um, change the name. Oh, I can change the name of it. Ooh, nice. Okay, cool. I didn't know that. Well, we're not gonna do anything with it, but oh well, we are really messed with it. So let's just call it. Let's just call it original, because <laughs> I'm so original when it comes to names. All right, let's call it original, so you know which one's which. There we go. Alrighty. So we got that green mystery data. So we went that way already, and we are gonna have battles here. I want to try to avoid. Void. So let me. Oh jeez. Okay. Oh jeez. Okay, that's not good. Okay, that was really bad just now. Okay, I was not expecting to take damage already, but it happened. So it was bound to happen. We all knew that. Okay. Oh yeah, it doesn't tell you the name of it. That's, I thought it did, but I guess not. Okay. So yeah, just one of these will be good. 
There we go. And we get the item from the battle. It's pretty cool, and it's money. Well, no, it's not. It's a bug frag. Nice. Okay, cool. So let's keep on going. We do have... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, that was, that was so close. We got GMD right here, which is a mini bomb asterisk. I guess we'll come in handy. Um, anything else in this in this area? No, there's not. Okay. Well, you do, yeah, we do have some more stuff down here. Okay, so I really want to try to heal myself up as quickly as possible, so. Let me do that. Let's get a counter hit there. Just avoid that one for the time being. Okay. We could use area grab. I, I, I still want to heal myself, so let's keep on doing that. Alright, get the counter hit on you, and then one move from one move from a sword or something will do enough damage to you. Because you only have one range attack. So I can what I can do. I can do this. Bam. Easy. We're almost back at our full health, so we're chilling. Fire hit. There we go. Cool, cool. Oh, oh no 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 no. Oh, oh Jesus. Okay, well, that's what happens when you get hit when you get caught. You get you lose 10 HP. That was bound to happen. It was, it was bound to happen. It's fine. It's fine. Burning someone. Calm down. I'm going to put the fire out now. All right. Phew. That was bad. There are many dangers ahead. Please be careful. Alrighty. Okay. Well, we saved two. I believe there's three we have to save, if I remember correctly. From the according to the guide. Wait, we want to keep looking around to be sure we get all this all the mystery data. Okay. Oh, there's another BMD right there. These are two two that we want to get for sure. Just keep on healing. Alrighty. Got an HP memory, which we love that. We love getting HP memories. And here's the third one. Just all around. Ah, hot, hot, hot. At this rate, I'll breathe burnt to a crisp. I don't want to be deleted. Don't panic, it'll be okay. Phew, any later and I would have been toast. You be careful too, you hear? Don't get burnt. Len, the temperature in this area is going down. Oh, perfect. All right, there we go. As I thought, you are skilled. However, a raging inferno awaits you in the next area. If you're feeling faint, maybe you should jack out. Oopsies. But even if you do, the Inferno will still be here. Good luck, Mega Man. <laughs> Darn it. You okay, Lan? Yeah. But the teachers are still in danger. You've got to hurry. Yeah. Alright, cool. Alright, so let's head on to the next area here. Alrighty, what do we got going on? What's wrong, Mega Man? It's really hot. Yeah, I know. What you mean? What you mean? The control panel is burning hot, too. Oh, Jesus. Wah! Mega Man! Is it Blast Man? Land. Everything just burnt it, burst into flames. Can you turn on the teacher's room's fire extinguisher? The extinguisher? But there's no Navi to operate it. I got it. Hang on, Mega Man. Hey, Mick, where's your Navi? No clue. He just went off on his own. Because what we want to do here, we want to keep on talking to Mick so we can, hopefully he can, his Navi can pop up and help us out here. So you're an operator, huh? If you've been with your Navi for a long time, you should know each other's patterns in and out. Mick! He's probably near the electronics. You can't see it, but he's a worrier. So I bet he's watching from, from a monitor somewhere. A monitor, huh? Makes sense. Let's go. And Abby doesn't look like it. Okay. Alrighty. So here maybe? It's the control panel for the blackboard. You can change on what which one? No. Okay. So oh. Here maybe? Self controls all security inside the you can jack in. Okay, no. Oh wait, is it this one right here? Oh okay, yeah, this is the only orange one out of all these blue ones. Found him! You're Mick's Navi, right? 
What are you doing here? Your operator is in trouble. He put some other navvy in his PET. He looked dangerous, so I just said, oh well. You're kidding, right? Aren't you following Mick because you're worried? Um... Mick, I need you two to work together. Stop this fighting and apologize. And let your navvy back into your PET. But... He's the one that ran out on me. He should be apologizing to me. What? I'm the one who's I'm the one who's watching who's always watching out for you. And do something. Hurry. Ah. Ouch! Mick! Mick! Ugh. Where are the fire extinguisher systems controls? Found it! Darn, it's protected. Hang on, Mick, I'll save you, no matter what. Ugh. Fire extinguisher system activated! Okay, we're chilling, we're chilling. Are you okay? Strangely enough, I'm okay. You big dummy. Hey, wait a sec, you said that like you meant it. Okay, we're good. Everything's good here, though. Not bursting into flames anymore. Mega Man, it's up to you now. Alright, nice. The flames are gone. Thanks, Lan. You should thank Mix Navi. <laughs> Whatever. I wasn't trying to help Mega Man out. Anyway, go get Blast Man for me. All of this is his fault. You got it. It's up to you, Mega Man. Roger. Alrighty. So, there's gonna be a couple of BMDs here too that we're gonna we're gonna, we're gonna want to grab, but not get caught by these flames. Oh my gosh. Okay, that was close. That was a close one. Oh my. Oh, it's it's a lot faster this time around. Okay, that's kind of scary. Okay. Oh jeez. Uh, okay. We're good. We're good. We're good. All right, we're chilling. It's, yeah, it's going a lot faster this time around. Ooh, we got a new enemy here, Old Stove. Um, let's try out this white capsule. See what exactly it does. Does this one move? Yes, it does. Oh, okay, okay, yeah. Oh yeah, I remember you. There we go. I wanted to get rid of that. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and use the this here. Okay, we didn't get the counter, but that's fine. Took took a bit longer, 23 seconds, but that's okay. Alrighty. Gosh, tell me why I wasn't left behind. I swear I'll be a, a good little program from now on. Have a little more faith. I'll save you. Alright, cool, cool. So yeah, just so like I was saying, there's gonna be two BMDs we wanna grab and then one. GMD you want to grab, so remember that. Which the the GMD is right behind us, or right right to the left of us. I really swear I'll be a good program from now on, just like you. Okay, bye bye. Alrighty, good. That's one. There's gonna be four in this area that we have to we have to save. I'll be sure I'll grab everything and avoid fireballs. Okay, keep on going. Oh jeez, okay, that was bad. Oh man, that was that was so bad. I was hoping for an HP recovery, but that's fine. Alrighty. Here's number two. It's no good. The memory of that time is coming back like a bad dream. You mustn't give up. I can still help you. Alright, that's number two. Got two more we gotta find in this area. Whoa. Thought I saw the afterlife for a second there. Talk about a close one. I'm gonna go find shelter. What a bad experience. You best be on guard too. Wouldn't wouldn't uh, wouldn't want you to burn up. All right. We'll do. All right. Let's head back to the beginning of this area so we can look for the other two. All right. We got a fire burn one F. But that's a new one. So here's there's a BMD and the GMD was on the other side, which is a regular up two, which means like I just saw our reg regular memory went up two. And we got a Vulcan 1 asterisk. But yeah, if you're, if you're not completely behind these blocks, you'll you'll get hit no matter what. Third, Mr. Program. No, I don't want to burn out here. There are still things I want to do in this world. There's this and that. Oh, just too many things. Everything will be okay. I'm here for you. You'll get a chance to do everything you want to. Because I'm going to save you because I'm Mega Man. 
Yes, I can feel it now. That wonderful feeling of being alive. I want to thank you, really. And to say, watch out ahead. All right, we got one more of Mr. Program. We gotta, we gotta go save. So let's try, let's try to look for the second uh, BMD before we forget. We should be on this opposite side here. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, we, 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 are almost, we are almost, we almost screwed up big time there. Oh my God, we can cut it. We can cut it with this. Okay, we're good. It really is mind over matter. If you think the fire's cold and really think that, no, actually, it really is hot. Hold on, I'll save you. We got you, Mr. Program. <sighs> that saying is just a saying, after all. Hot is hot, no matter what you think. I won't be that na naive again. And you too. Don't be fooled, just be careful. Alright, nice. Alright, and there we go. We got a skull on the ground there. And we got a GMD right here. 450 zennies. Okay, nice. Nothing over there. We got a BMD right here. Recovery 30 asterisk. Perfect. And we got a fire hit, and we got a boomer. Nice. Alrighty, cool. I believe we got gotten everything we can get here. Let's just double check. So next up, we seems like we have Blastman we have to face off against here in a second. Let's go ahead and save real quick because we do not want to die. Dying would not be fun. All right, let's do this. First boss fight of the uh, of the of the series or of the of the playthrough. Whoa, you made it! I applaud you for reaching uh, reaching me unburnt, but I doubt that even you can stay cool-headed forever. <laughs> Blast man, I won't let you get away with this. You can't stand up to me. I'll delete every last fragment of your data. Whoa, here he comes, Lan. Gotcha. Battery team set. Execute. Burn to ashes. <laughs> oh man, okay. Okay. This is gonna be kinda scary. But what I want to save up for, I want to save up for a mega cannon. Which is basically gonna be the way I can get a mega cannon is by getting an A, B, and R C cannon chip. If I can get those two, we'll be good to go. So for right now I'm gonna use these. Uh so we don't have we don't have a we don't have a super with that. So I just gotta find out this guy's movements because I don't know what his movements are. Okay, okay. So he moves he moves four times. Okay, so we can't do anything. Okay. Oh yes he can. Okay. Okay, we got him. Alright. Let's go ahead and heal up. And then we're gonna use our wide sword. There we go. So the best way I think the best way to go about this is to stay behind these blocks. Because that gives us a better advantage of not actually getting hit. Um, got a wide sword now. Got a buster up. Let's do that. But we can move up here. Perfect. And we're doing 20 damage now. Because of our buster up. Oh, jeez. Okay. That was... Okay, that was scary. Let's use the Vulcan. Actually, we should be able to take a couple more hits if we take many more. Now let's go ahead and heal up a little bit. So we're close. He's at 100, so we should be able to finish this off soon. Okay. So how do I know where, where it's going to... Okay, I don't, I don't... I won't know where he's going to shoot it. I'm really trying to get an air, uh, our Mega Cannon here so we can add that to our list of stuff. So I'm going to be waiting a little bit till we... So by attacking with the sword, he's going to die. But I want to get the... Oh, we still have the Buster up. Okay, I did not know we, I did not know we still have the Buster up! Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of wasting chips right now because I really want to get that cannon. So we can take... We can probably take two more hits. The, the move that I'm scared of the most is that one. So I think... Okay, yeah. So it does 20 damage. I think I don't think we're, we're going to be able to do it. I, I, want, I really wanted to get it. We're probably going to get it later. Save it for later. Let's just go ahead and. I did not mean to do that. <laughs> I meant to go. I meant to go for it. Okay, we, we can take one more turn. Oh, okay, we still have some more healing. So we can, now we can take. We can take. We, well, we still only take two. Come on, give me the cannon, please. No, it's not giving me. The, it's not giving me what I want. Okay. Okay, you know what? That's fine. We're just going to have to deal do deal what we got. Let's finish it. And we got a counter hit for it. I wanted to get the Mega Buster, but it just wouldn't happen. Took me two minutes and five five seconds. Cool. Let me get a thousand zennies from it. I really wanted to get the Mega Blaster there, but oh well. That's fine. Cool. To lose to a brat like you. What good things have come to this. He's going to give me another one of his lectures. Who? You have won this battle, but this is this is only round one. Next time. He'll be burnt to a crisp. 
Wait. Well, that's that's that. Mega Man, are you okay? Things are okay here. Deck out, Mega Man. Roger. We beat Blast Man, and the whole thing at school ended. It was decided that this time it was an outside intruder, Blast Man, who caused the whole mess. But it looks like Mick made the teachers really mad. Well, maybe this will this will make him change his ways. <laughs> Don't bet on it. Oh yeah, Mick. Mick. It's not like I've changed for any or anything. But I've been thinking a little. I've been giving you a lot of trouble. That was wrong of me. Mick. It's okay. How about us being friends? I still don't have that many friends to hang out with here. No way, freak. That's not my kind of thing. I just want a net battle sometime. And totally own you two. Huh. He kind of reminds me of Dex. Mr. Hikari. Oh, Mr. Hikari! T tab Mr. Hikari! Hi, I'm Tab. I'd really like to be your friend, too. Sure, but please don't call me Mr. Hikari. Mr. Call me Lan. We're the same age, after all. Yeah, and don't call me- don't call me Mr. either. Ah, keep quiet for a second, Mick. Mr. Hikari, uh, Lan, I was so impressed by your battle. Especially your techniques. The way you stayed calm during the incident. You didn't look like a ki- like a ki- uh, excuse me, like a kid at all. I really respect you. That's why I called you Mr. Hikari. But I don't respect Mick at all, so I don't call him Mr. Uh, well, whatever. Hey, Lan. What are you looking so serious for? Shut up! <clears throat> Lan. So, all these things kind of happened since you got here, but I... I was really impressed today. Uh, I don't like saying sorry. So here, take this. We got graffiti. What's this? Your doodles? No! And it's graffiti, not doodles. I mean... That graffiti's gonna show you where the key for the door between Central Area 2 and Central Area 3 is hidden. I should know. I hid the key and wrote that note. What a troublemaker. With that, you can get to the Psybeast statues in Central Area 3. Psybeast? Everyone knows about Cyber City's legendary beasts. Really? I'll let you borrow that for now. Later, freak. Oh, he's, he's totally my friend now. He is totally my friend now. Why can't you apologize like a normal person? He's a rebel, so him giving that to you shows he's sorry. Yeah, when you put it like that, it does seem like his style. Oh, it's already time to go home. Actually, my house is in the Central, central Town ships, Chip Store. The store is called Asterland. We're in the middle of remodeling, so we're not open, but once we're finished, I really hope you'll come by. Well, I've got to go home and help with the remodeling. I'll see you tomorrow, Lan. Yeah, see you tomorrow. Okay. Alright. Looks like school's gonna get pretty busy from now on. Well, let's go check out the Central Area 3 and the Psybeast statues. Okay. Oh, before we do, we should look at the, that graffiti you got earlier. You can look at it in your key items. Okay. Alrighty, so before we do anything, there's a picture of a navvy digging a hole in, out of place on a wide green road where a shadow falls. Okay. What we want to do next... We're actually going to go, before we, ho before we go home, we're actually going to go to uh, room 6-2, because we're going go to go into another another net, so we can try to get some more items. Okay, so this is what I wanted to grab, this is what I wanted to get uh, in the Blast Man fight. Is the, we want to get cannon A, B, and C, because if we do that, we get a program advance, which is going to be our Giga Cannon 1. So, as soon as, as, soon as this guy gets in our range, we go ahead and attack him. Massive damage, and we got the counter hit. So yeah, we, I wanted to get that because it'll add it to our uh, list of Giga Giga chips that we, that we have. That's why I'm back in. That's why I'm. That's why I am back in in the Robo compu uh, computer for that reason. And also because there's 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 a specific uh, GMD I want to get because the GMDs respawn every single time you go in and out of a uh, of an area. It'll always respawn. So I want to get a specific chip that we're, that we can get in this area, which is a cannon asterisk. Because if we get a cannon asterisk, we can do, we can do A, B, and then an asterisk cannon that'll still give us the mega cannon, if I if I remember correctly. So if we go into our library here, I believe it's our library. Um, we go to PA memo, which is gonna be the Giga Cannon. 
So, yeah, getting canon one. So that just goes to show that there's another version of it. Okay, it took a while. To, cause I, was trying to, I was trying to find a canon asterisk, but I don't think it is. A, I don't think the what we find because I think it just goes on a rotation whenever you go in and out of the uh, program. So I went in and out of the ro of the Robo com uh, computer, and it just it kind of just went in a in a circle pretty much. So I would get 800 Zennies for one, or, or I would get Vulcan Vulcan one asterisk, and then I would get uh, something else, something else. Uh, I don't know. I, don't, I think it just rotates each time. If not, then I'll probably go back and try try again later. But I've already done plenty of that just now. I just passed, I just spent the past like 20 minutes looking around for a cannon asterisk. But we did we do have another another um, Giga or not Giga, but uh, PA we can use now. It's going to be Vulcan one, Vulcan Beast asterisk and D for BCD A B C D. So that's going to be another one we can use. So we'll, hopefully we'll be able to use that soon enough. But anyways, the plan was to head to six two and log in or jack into the program in there because we're, we can get a couple of things from there from there so that's what we want to do we want to be sure we try to get everything as much as possible that's why i want to i want to try to show you as much as possible in this game because i know not many people play these games anymore like play these older games so i was like you know what why not why not i show it off so that's what i'm going to do i believe it's this i have to I have to log into yeah it's a class 6 2 computer this is a class 6 2 computer it is used for virus busting class. If you ask me, the students in 6-2 are a hair more incredible than the 6 ones. Oh wow, thanks. So yeah, we have the BMD here, which is going to be a regular up 2. And there should be one more. Uh, we have an unlocker one too, so we have to mark that. We have to make a note of that, I'm probably going to forget honestly. But if you, but another way to grind for like money and stuff like that is just to go in and out of a, a computer. Depending on how much zen you get from that particular from that particular computer, I kept getting 800 and 300 zennies from it, which is cool by me because now I'm at, now I'm sitting at 9100, I believe, in zenny. Um, so, so that's a way to grind for money. 9250 now, that's a way to grind for money. So keep that in mind. Uh, I can't do anything with that because I need an unlocker chip for that. But there should be one more BMD in this area to grab. Okay, so I made a mistake. So, so you get the uh, reg regular up from class six two, but you'll get. A, we get another item, another chip from this area. This is classroom 1-1, one, one, which is going to be right here. It's going to be an energy bomb K. I did get a couple of energy bombs um, in the robo computer as well. I don't think I got a K one. I think I got another one too. Let's see, okay, so. So yeah, it's not, it's not the same. So, so I, don't, I don't think there's going to be a, a giga one for this one. That's fine. But that's because because typically there's, there's always going to be one BMD and potentially one PMD in each uh, individual data or data each individual computer. Okay, so there was another BMD. Typically, there's only one BMD in each individual data. We got another, there's another one in here for a full ear uh, full energy. Excuse me for full energy. So that was pretty cool that we got that. This is class one one computer. A virus busting class is being held here. Of course, first graders still have a lot to learn, but don't tell anyone I said that. All right, and that's all that's in this area. So let's go ahead out of here. All right, so now, now, now that we're done with the school for the time being, so now we want to head home and log back into the next. We want to head make our way to Central Area Three. Let's head on home. Man, you kind of smell like smoke. Maybe I'm just imagining things. Nah, the, the school caught on fire. Nothing, nothing big. You have mail, man. Let's check out. Let's check out the email. Mail has been received in the mailbox and land HP. Confirm mail is called to Mr. Program on the homepage. This is the only mail notification you'll receive, so please check the mailbox and then from this point forward. Okay. So, so that's why you have to keep checking the mail, the mail stuff. Give you this. Lan, how are you? Everyone here is great. Dex is a little lonely though. Oh yeah, I forgot to give something to you when, when you moved. So I'll just send it to you instead. And we got roll R. So if you don't know, so if you haven't played the Battle Network series before, what roll R is, is basically you can, you can attack and uh, heal yourself up as well. I don't think I'm necessarily going to really need it right now. But there's really nothing I want to get rid of that's in my current folder. Um, because what we have is actually really good so far. I mean, this one doesn't really, I mean, honestly, if I can get an asterisk roll or something like that, that'd be pretty cool. But I don't think you can. I think you only get the letter that's the same as the first letter of the name. I'm not too sure when it comes to, uh, uh navvies. But I, I want to see if I can if I can make this work. I don't know, I don't I don't know how to make this work. So we're not gonna worry about switching out roll right now. And now we're back in central area two. So so if we look back at this riddle, 
uh, that we received, the graffiti, there's a picture of a, or not real, necessarily a riddle, but some, some uh, information, whatever. There's a picture of a Navi digging a hole in the place on a wide green road where a shadow falls. So we have, so we have to follow this, this road and look for where a shadow might be, I guess, right here? Aha. Uh -huh. Do I just get his, there's actually a couple here. Okay. Oh, here we go. Isn't this that spot on mixed graffiti? The graffiti did, a, did have a picture of a Navi digging. I wonder what's under this panel. Let's check it out. What's in here? And we got the key data. Man, this is, the, this is that key data Mick was talking about. All right, let's go check out Central Area 3. Okay, if there's gonna be some dead ends where you can actually bump into other navvies, and, and in that way you'll be able to recruit them. Well, not recruit them, but not recruit them, but you'll be able to fight them and bring them to, or get their chip. So it might be this one right here. I'm not too sure which one it is. It might be actually. Yep. So as you can see, we fight Blastman EX, which is basically a, a a harder version of Blastman. So we gotta keep that in mind. We, we have to remember all this stuff. This isn't the best start start off start to start off, but that's okay. So we can, we can use both of these to start off. We can also use this as well. So let's see where he lands. We got a counter hit on him. Get some more damage on him. You don't have to beat him in a specific time. Um, I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to get him in that corner. Yes, perfect. So you gotta remember that he does a lot more damage this time around. But as soon as you beat him, you'll be able to receive uh, his his chip. I want to stay behind this just in case he decides to do his super move. Uh, I want to go and use these so we can heal up our health. Oh man, he, he has he has a distance. He has a distance on him. But yeah, so so you'll be able to fight pretty much every uh, navy you, you fought in the past because they are a lot tougher than their story counterparts. Okay, if I can hit this program advance, I'll be able to I'll, I'll be able to get pretty close to finishing him off. Okay, we got a counter hit. See, now we can just get a couple of power shots and avoid his his, uh, his other move. We'll be able to get through this. Oh, yes! We did it! Okay. Whew! That was close. But with that, now we get the Blast Man B chip. Are we going to use it? Probably not, but it's good to have. Um, but and I think, yeah, after, even if you take a lot of damage from it, you do heal up right afterwards, which is going to be really, really nice. Um, so luckily, I've gotten better about stress now when it comes to Mega Man battles. But now we got uh, Blast Man B, head forward, and launch Blast Attack. So he could very well come in handy at some point. So you know what, we're actually going to go ahead and equip him. Um, just because so, I, don't, I don't really think I'm ever going to use this white capsule, if, if I'm being completely honest. Because 120 damage is a lot of damage, especially in early game. So, if I remember, if I, if I remember anything, if I remember anything from my past, my past playthroughs from Battle Networks one through five, is to have as much damage healing as possible, but along with a whole bunch of program advances that you can have to do massive damage to beat them. So, so we'll try it out. If it doesn't work out, then we're not gonna worry about it. But it's good. It's good to have. So now that we have him, I'm gonna go ahead and save real quick, and now we're gonna head to Central Area three. Mega Man, use key data. Alrighty. Oh wait, there's a green, there's a GMB right here. Go ahead and grab it. Mini bomb R. Eh. Okay, so there's multiple. Ooh, wow, there's multiple different paths here. Okay. Welcome to Central Area Three, Central Area's best sightseeing spot. Did you already see the stone monument to the side beast? If those monsters really existed, it'd be awful. If you hadn't seen it, seen it yet, it's a, it's behind this area. There is one BMD you want to get in this area. <sighs> this area is nice and wide, perfect for training. And right, we got another, we got an unlocker here. Don't want to head there yet. That's when the progress story. We do want to get that BMD right here. Grab this BMD. And it's going to be a high cannon L. So I'm not going to equip the high cannon L because we can't use, really use it with anything else. We don't, we don't even have we don't even have any other L's. Oh, I mean we do. We have mini bomb L's, but I think we'll be okay without the high cannon for the time being. So basically, this is the second. This is the second. Uh, Second tier, I guess you could say, second tier cannon that you can get, and if, and if you can, and there is going to be a uh, program advance for this as well. But we obviously we are nowhere near close to getting that because we need, I believe, L M N. We need M and N in order to get it. So and that's probably it's probably going to be a while till we get that. So, but yeah, just wanted to grab that BMD before we do anything else. Got a GMD right here for Vulcan One D. 
I obviously can't do anything with that, so we're not even gonna try it. Cold Christmas tree. Or cyber tree. It's a very strong tree, so it won't be easy to cut down. You didn't see the suspicious navy? Hm. Didn't see it, huh? I guess that's good. Got another GMD right here, 300 zennies, so we're now sitting at 10,000, I believe. Heck yeah. Alright, let's go ahead and examine these statues. Long ago, there were two beasts with great powers on net. These two beasts were not friendly to each other, rather. They fought each other again and again. They fought fiercely and greatly changed the face of the net. People feared these two beasts and called them Psybeasts. One of the Psybeasts was shaped like a great wolf. Psybeast Gregor. Hey, that's the version we're playing. Its roar, its roar was enough to cause the whole net to shake, and it devoured many navvies with its sharp fangs. The other Psybeast was a giant bird-like beast. Saibis Falzar. With its huge wings, it scattered objects all over the net, and with its razor-sharp claws, it shredded many programs. This is where the two Saibis' reign of terror ended, where they fought each other to the end. The chasm in this area was born from their clash, and the bottom of this pit is known as the Underground. It is said that even now, the Saibis are sleeping there. Oh, wow. The legendary Saibis. Hmm. I guess they have a legend about them in this area of the net. Sounds really interesting, huh, Lan? Yeah, sounds like the net's just full of these mysteries. Look oh, cool. Lan, it's time for bed. Huh? It's already bedtime? Ah! Okay, Mega Man. One more look around and then we gotta jack out. Okay. No, we're, we're good. We, we've done everything we can for the time being, so let's go ahead and head on out of here. And head to bed. Feels so good to play this on the Switch, man. Excuse me. Welcome, Dr. He Dr. Hikari. I've been waiting for you. It is an honor, Mayor, Ch Mayor Kane. I've heard that you are quite involved in town affairs, but school too. Should I call you principal? While we are here in school? No, 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 no. I've got my hands full taking care of the expo. I'm leaving school affairs to the vice principal. So, with greetings out of the way, let's get down to business. Do you have the program with you? Yes. But this program is not known to the general public. Hey, do you know of, this, of his existence? I know a person who used to work in the Psy Lab. He knows about this program which you made 11 years ago. Is that so? Well, I only brought one part of the whole program today. It is not that I don't trust you, and while this program in its entirety is quite useful, there are great risks should it fall into evil hands. I see. You scientists take risks seriously. I suppose it's because the technology you make changes society, so you feel the need to guard it closely. Well, yes, in a way. What I meant was, even though this is only one part, I believe it is more than enough to complete the task. For example, even if the net access increased by 30-fold, this program, once installed, can fully support the network. I see. It can greatly boost memory capacity. Talk to Hikari. Let us try for the most successful expo. <laughs> mm, hope he's not evil. The next day. Alright, I'm taking attendance. Tab. Here. Alice. Here. Mick. Nick? Play it again. You'll never learn to wake up on time. Is that him right there? I'm here, I'm here! I'm blazing down the hallway. Only 15 more feet and I'll be there. Six more feet. No running in the halls. Honestly, you never change. Hmm. What the? Is that a penguin? Uh, uh, Just made it. Huh? What? What the? What? What's everyone so surprised at? Mick, what is that thing behind you? Behind me? Ah! What is this thing? You brought it here, didn't you? I don't know nothing about this bird. Get away! Shoot! Shoot! That's funny. 
Oh no, it's just it's, it's just following him. Ugh. <laughs> uh, what's with you? Looks like it's attached itself to you. Any idea why? Why? Oh, now I remember. I gave it some food yesterday. What a strange penguin. Or pigeon. Uh, Mick? Oh, okay. That's not a pigeon. It's a penguin. Oh. So this is the pelican? But this is the pelican? Uh, that's enough for now. That penguin seems to really like you. But for now, try to take good care of it. What? Why? Well, you can't just ditch the bird. Yeah, but... Hmm, why me? I don't know, man. There's something strange about that penguin land. Hmm. Maybe it is pelican. <laughs> wow. Land. Wow. After school. Ding dong, a bing bong, everybody. Ugh, school's finally over. Hmm? Squawk! Squawk! I can't really do a good squawk voice. <laughs> That's just my mic. I don't even know if my mic captures it or not, or if it just cuts it. I don't even know, man. Squawk! Squawk! What's with you? Making a racket all of a sudden? Ugh. That's some noise it's making. Maybe it's hungry? You think it's hungry? I don't have any more of that pigeon food. Speaking of which, what do penguins eat? Hmm. Maybe we should ask the biology teacher. Tell you what, Mick. I'll find some bird food for you. You just hang tight here and watch the penguin, okay? I don't really want to owe you. But I don't want to leave this penguin alone either. Gotta choose, gotta choose. Alright, you better find me some bird food or else. Or else what? What are you gonna do? I'm begging you quick squawking. Every time I try to get away, he just follows me crying. I can't move, I just can't move. So I'm trusting you to get some food. Alright. Alright. You do want to I do want to head to, to classroom one two though, real quick. Because there's gonna be a girl here. Uh back here. Hey, do you know do you have an energy bomb cake chip? And I believe I do. And, we, and she'll trade it for a double shot. Wanna show it off in class, please? Pretty sure I have one, yeah. Awesome, thanks, I'm so happy. Now I have something to show everyone in class. Okay, so what exactly does that do? Uh, shoots, ooh, oh wow, shoots two panels at an enemy. Okay. So it's better than the one we currently have? Okay, so that's the upgraded version of it. Okay, but these are asterisks though, and they do the same amount of damage. I'll stick with these. There's your asterisk. Okay, so we gotta find some food. I'm guessing we can just go to the teacher's lounge, maybe? And they'll have some food for us. Do you? Ah, I have to carry you for my class. I guess it's over time for me. That's not you. It has to be somebody in a lab coat. You? I have something I'd like to ask. Yes, yes, what is it? Hmm, what, is, what does the penguin eat? Let me see. They would eat fish, I suppose. I see, fish. What makes you ask such a strange question? What well, the truth is, you got you got to feed a hungry penguin. Hmm. Well, I don't have any fish you could use as food. If anyone around here would, would have something, it would be the biology teacher's aide. He feeds the animals here every day, so you should go ask him. The biology teacher's aide. Gotcha. Thanks. Okay, and who's that? Huh? The student you've been watching who makes weird face at the security camera in the hallway. What are you doing, kid? Don't get in the way. I'm making a funny face at the camera. Whoever's on the other side of, of the camera is in for a surprise. You a biology teacher's aide? What should I do after school? Nap out on the net? Or go check out some chips at the chip shop? Mm, decisions, decisions. No, not you. Is it true that a pelican showed up at school? Huh? A penguin? I heard it was a pelican. Who makes up a pelican with a penguin? What a wonderful technique. That brush strokes are very elegant. Looks like that penguin is really attached to Mick. That's gotta be rough. Huh? That's right, I'm the bi- Okay, I'm the biology teacher's aide. Something the matter? Um, what? You want some fi fish to feed a penguin? Well, I am in charge of feeding the animals here. I don't have any food to give to a penguin. Guess I'm out of luck. Thanks anyways. Oh, wait a second. My grandpa loves fish. I'm sure he's even fishing today. He should be coming home around now, I think. If you ask him, I, I bet he'd give, you he'd give you a fish. Really? Yeah, I don't think it'll be a problem. I'll try and get a hold of my grandpa. 
I'll ask him to bring some fish to the Lev bus station. Thanks. I'll head to the station right now. What's the matter, mister? My grandkid told me to bring some fish that I caught. Here, but the ice box I used for it to fish is broken. Can't open the lid. Fish, huh? This has to be the man I, that I heard about. All right. Mister, could you please show me the this ice box? Mega Man, this has got to be... Yup, that's probably a virus's fault. We'll delete, if we delete the virus, the ice box will go back to normal. Ready to battle? Sure, is it going to be super hard? Am I going to die? Eh, it doesn't seem like it's too bad. Okay, let's see what we can do. Oh yeah, I, I always hated the bubble stuff. Ah, okay. Okay, cool. Let's heal up. That leaves me with just you. Oh, okay, so you definitely mini bomb. It just, it just hit him no matter what, so. Ooh, okay, we're good, we're good. Ah, thank you. Thanks to you, the icebox is back to normal. But you... I see, I see. Are you the youngin' looking for fish? I've heard of you. Could you help the icebox? I'll give you a fish. Thanks, mister. Alright, cool. So let's head back to the school and turn this in real quick. Alright, I brought I brought you some tasty fish. Ta-da! Squawk? Hey, he really likes it. I still wonder where this penguin came from. You wouldn't happen to know, would you? I don't know. Heck, I'm a stuck it for a pigeon. Totally clueless. Land. Maybe it's time to search for our answers on the net? Wanna check out some of the BBSs? There's all sorts of stuff there, so maybe we can find a clue. Yeah, we might be able to find something there. If you want to go to the B to a BBS, there's one in uh, Seaside Area 1. You can go to Seaside Area from Central Area 3. I can go with you, but this penguin's going to trip us up. Nah, it'll be okay. Besides, you two make a good pair. A good pair? Don't be a moron. What kind of guy do you think I am? I'm going to get you back real good in a net battle one day. Okay, okay. Anyway, leave the BBS search to me. Alright, cool. Guess I'm like a big brother to this thing. Who do you think I am? I can still destroy you in a net battle. Okay, okay. Alright, let's head back home and head, up, head into the net. Hello, Lan. How have you been lately? You've been doing your homework, right? And not being late either, I hope. How about your friends? I'm sure you haven't had any trouble making new friends. Everyone here in ACDC Town is doing great. You should come visit as soon as you can. I'm looking forward to seeing you again. Yo, Lan! Been a long time. Ever since you moved, me and Gusman have been training hard. I doubt you can beat me now. We were talking about you at school, and Miss Mary decided that we should all send you some email. Oh yeah, have you been using that chip data I sent you? I'm glad you are getting used to these to things. I'm not using it, but thanks. There's more? Oh, how are you? So, how is Cyber City as a place to live? I bet you're still Mr. Popular, even in Cyber City. I'm not sad, you're gone at all, but if you start feeling lonely, you should come and visit. Oh? You have mail, man. Check out the email. What do we got? Caution. Dead advisory. Lately, there, uh, there has been a breakdown of order in, on the net. We would like to report that some navvies have been attacked. Due to this, we advise exercising caution. Okay. Got a bug frag. There have been a lot of net quakes around here lately. Speaking of, there have also been attacks on navvies. Hope there isn't something bad going on. I don't know blue navy running around here. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? Where did I lose it? I wonder. Oh no, work will be upset with me now. What's the matter? Huh? It's nothing. It's nothing at all. I'm fine. Ah. Uh, doesn't seem fine to me. He said he is fine, so let's just hurry up and get moving. Oh, there's a black navy chilling over here. I wonder how you get to that path up there. Oh, so here's here's another another potential uh, program advance, I believe. I believe this will work, right? Oh no, it doesn't. Huh. Is it wrong? I could've sworn it was I could have sworn that was one. I guess not, huh? I thought it was a program advance, but I guess it was not. I guess I was wrong. That's fine. I could have sworn it was. Alright, but here's that here's that black navy. You look like a tough guy. How about you test your skills? If you're able to defeat my viruses, you win. Of course, if you do, you'll be rewarded. But if you lose, I'll delete you with extreme prejudice. Okay, so if, before you fight this guy, you want we're gonna wanna save because this guy's gonna be a little bit tougher. Uh, compared to the ones that we've already faced. Because this guy, I he's gonna have some tough, tough peeps. Like, yeah. He has, I believe he has second tier 
uh, second tier enemies here. So that's kind of that's kind of scary, but we should be okay. Ah, okay. Okay, we got rid of that. I want to get rid of that dude right there. Okay, that. Okay, that paralyzed me, but I got to counter hit. Okay, we got him. We're good. We're good. We're chilling. We took we took some good damage from that, but we're healed back up. Wow, I'm impressed. That battle is absolute fire. All right, so here's your reward. And we got sub memory. The number of subjects you can hold. Ooh, okay, has increased. That was a great battle. Off to central area three we go. Oh whoa. Ugh. I think I heard a terrible voice from back there. I'm still in shock. Hey, are you okay? All right, so there's a pink navy here. Ah, uh, you've got something to do in Seaside Area too. This is the road that heads to Seaside Area. However, there is a, le a leak that is blocking the road. That's no good. Yeah, I know. A repairman was just called. He said he'd be better. He'd be here right away, but there's no sign of him. No sign of him. Bet he's here somewhere close by. Should we try to find him, Lan? Yeah, let's do that. Okay, I kind of want to test out what Blastman does exactly. So it said, push it two. Oh. Oh. Okay. Cool. All right. I that'll probably come in handy. All right, but we're back in Central Central One. He's not running around anymore. So what's up, dude? I'm in trouble. I can't go to work without it. Um, excuse me? You wouldn't be the repair navy, would you? How did you know? I thought so. They're waiting for you to fix the leak in Central Area 3. Oh, I'm sorry I'm late. The truth is I can't seem to find my tool program. And I really need it for work. Without it, I can't fix the leak. Do you remember where you dropped your tool program? Well, I've been so busy these days. I've been to lots of places to make repairs. So I can't narrow it down to one place. Well, it would be very hard for you to find it alone. So I'll help you go around to the places you visited. Really? That'd really help out a lot. Let's split up and look for the tool program. Where should I look? Hmm. Today I went to several homes in Central Town. I may have dropped in the computer at one of those homes. Do you mind checking that out for me? I'll check out the other places. Houses in, houses in Central Town. Got it. Let's head on out of here then. Alrighty. So, if we go into our bathroom, our moms will be here. This sure is a problem. What's wrong? The toilet broke, and even the repairman came to fix it, it just broke again. A repairman came to fix it? Is that the... Well, if we, if we click on it, we can jack into the toilet. We love it. And there's a matar with a plunger on its head. Okay, we love that. Ah. Hey, Lan. Don't tell me that's the tool program. I guess that's it. So what's it doing here, doing there? Well, let's delete that virus first. Mom is getting kind of embarrassed. Uh, Lan, I really don't want to fight this guy. I mean, that doesn't look like a tool to me. Looks looks more like that thing you use when the toilet is stuck. Battery routine set. Lan, are you even listening? Battery routine set. Ugh. Execute. Oh, jeez. We have three Metars. We got Metar 1, 2, and 3. So th 3 is obviously the third tier. We can go ahead and get rid of the first one. Okay, we got the counter hit on that. Take care of the second one. Oh, okay, so he moves. Oh, dang. The steps goes fast. Okay. There we go. Now it's just you and me, buddy. Just you and me, buddy. Alright, we got Vulcan. We got another counter hit. Nice. Alright. Mega Man got tool program. Land, let's make sure the repair navy gets this. Okay, time to jack out, Mega Man. Raj. Huh? It's your auto phone, Land. Hello, repair man here. Uh, actually, I'm the operator of the navy. I just lost the tool program. But for some reason, I just can't seem to find the tool program. Hmm. It's okay, we found it, mister. Really? Alright, you're a real help. Now I can do some work. Do you think you can bring the tool program to Central Area 3? Okay, no problem. Let's go to Central Area 3, Mega Man. Alrighty. Is there anything in here? Like any BMDs, anything like that? Oh, yep, there's a BMD right here. Ooh, ooh an unlocker. Okay. We can go ahead and use that on the one we have. Ooh. Oh, yikes. I got 200 zennies from that. You might not know it, but I'm really a toilet program. I can do things like release minus ions. Check it out. 
La 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 la. Ion power. Alrighty. So that's everything in here, it seems like. So we got an unlocker. So, that, so I believe there is an unlocker uh, PMD, a PMD that we can use in uh, Central Area 3. Let's talk to the repairman right here. Now that we got your tool program. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Here, this is the tool program you're looking for, right? Yes, yes, this is it. Uh, if I lost this, I wouldn't be able to get any work done. Finally, I can fit, get to work fixing these leaky pipes. Take this. Once more. Okay, finished. Finito. The end. Now this street is safe, safer all once again. Well, I'm off to my next job. Huh? Uh oh. Rumble, 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 rumble. Oh. What's going on? He'll stop soon, I think. Wow, it really stopped. There's been a lot of these quakes on the net recently. They're really very troublesome, I really. Those quakes are breaking pipes here, there, everywhere. Seems the center of these quakes is here, so be careful. Okay, I'm really going to my next job now. Alright, nice. Net quakes. I wonder what's causing them. I want to know too, but first, the mystery of the penguin. Mega Man, head for Seaside Area 1. Roger. Alrighty. This is Seaside Area 1, a perfect area for vacation and leisure. Alright, well I think this is a good place as any to end off this next, the second episode of Mega Man Bad Network 6. If you enjoyed this episode, go ahead and hit that like button, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe, become a Rosie today because we'd love to have you in our community. Anyways guys, in the next episode we'll go ahead and take on the seaside area and go from there. So thank y'all so very much for watching, hope y'all enjoying the playthrough so far because I know I am. Anyways guys, thank y'all so very much for watching, I can't wait to see y'all in the next episode. See y'all then.